Hi, I'm Nathan McAdoo, Technical Support Manager here at CPS Products. I'm here to introduce you to our new line of digital charging scales. The computer charge scales are completely 100% wireless. We no longer have specific controllers for them, but they are now used via your smartphone. The three models we have are the CC220W, the CC240W, and the CC840W. CC220W is completely wireless and does up to 220 pounds. The CC240 and the CC840W are both larger platform, uh, up to 240 pounds, and the 840W comes with charging solenoids as well. So the CC220W comes in a nice soft case now. It's easy to operate, or easy to open, easy to use in the field. The larger platforms, CC220W and CC840W, still come in a hard case. But as you can see, in both instances, we no longer have any controls. It simply comes with a battery, a manual, and the scale itself. To get started, you'll have to go to the, either your, your iOS store or your Android store and download the CPS Scale Link app. After the app is completely downloaded to your device, the first time you open it, you're going to go through some introductory sequences. So let's open it up here in our iPad. The first thing it's going to do from the start after you do the introduction, it's going to look for any devices it may have in the vicinity. To be be certain, let's say we have multiple scales in the vicinity, you know, several taxis and them that might have the same type. Every scale has a unique ID. So the first thing you're going to need to do is, is to locate the unique ID that your scale has. On all of the scales as they come, you'll be able to see it either on the side written on a label or on the label itself here on the bottom. From this number, you're going to be able to see it directly when you open up the home page of the app. As you can see here, we have several ones right now. I want to link to this one right now, and I know that it's the 16, the 160B20. I know that's the serial number of this device, so I'm simply going to click that. It's going to begin to connect. One of the, the best ways you're going to know from the device is it has an LED light right there. It's going to illuminate blue, and you're going to hear a small audio noise that... Uh, that signifies that we are now connected to the scale. From here, you want to find a nice flat surface to use your device. You're going to see now we've entered our home page of the app. And all of the similar function, if you're familiar with using a digital scale in the past, we have the tear button. It's going to be right here in the middle of the home page. So if you can see right now, I'm off a little bit. I know there's nothing on it. Simply tear it. It's going to get us back to zero. On this whole page, there's a few other things. You're always going to know what model number you're connected to up here. This one's a CC840W. Right here, it shows that we are connected via the Bluetooth. In the right upper corner, it's showing us our battery life. And right now, I'm sitting at 65%. And also, quickly from this page, you can either quickly enter a recovery mode or a charge mode. Charge on the left, and recover on the bottom right. Also from up here, what we're going to get into, I'm going to show you how to create jobs. You can create a job instantly in the right upper corner. The main function from the home screen is going to be in your upper left-hand corner with these three lines. It's going to bring you into a sub-menu. You can see home will always take you back to that page. The next one is tools. Tools is going to be a place where you can access clients, your jobs, your different tanks that you're tracking, Below that in the sub-menu are your settings. So again, you can set many of these settings in the introductory, but if you want to change them later on, you simply go to your settings tab. Here we have units. You can set your weight type, whether it's kilograms or pounds. You also have language. You can, uh, again, select a different language, or if someone else is speaking a different language and needs that now, you can change it. We have the resolution of the scale. We also have geographic corrections for different latitudes based on your location finder. And we also have a convenient tab here that tells you which different type of battery you have so it better tracks your battery life on the home page. Now back to our sub-menu, we next have the CPS blog. This is a place where we're going to give uh, frequent updates, different videos like the one you're watching now. Um, anything that CPS wants to let our, our users be aware of, um, you can always go to the blogs and get a lot of different information on not only this product but other products by CPS. And lastly, we have help. 
The help menu is going to have all of our videos, several different things if you're having any struggles with the device. Um, this is going to be the area inside the app where you're going to be directly able to find the answers to a lot of your questions. So lastly, we have an exit button here from our submenu. You can simply go into this instead of closing the app from your phone or from your device. You have a nice little submenu here that will allow you to just disconnect from your device. You'll hear an audio sound that allows you to know now that the scale has been shut off and we're no longer connected to the device. Thank you for watching. This is our introduction to the CPS Computer Charge Scale.